वेलकम टू द प्रोग्राम ए एस जी आई एस ए एस जी आई एस बिलीव इन क्वालिटी कमिटमेंट एंड सक्सेस सिंस टू थाउजेंड वन आई एम गाइडिंग द आई एस एस पेरेंट्स माई मेन फेथ इज ऑन माई स्टूडेंट्स बिकॉज दे डिड हार्ड वर्क आई हैव अ ग्रेट फेथ ऑन माई स्टूडेंट्स सो द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट आर्टिकल वॉट आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू द न्यू सरोगेसी बिल प्रोटेस्ट the interest of all the new surrogacy bill protects the interest of all this article was written by sri bhupender yadav ji and this article i have taken from the hindustan hind hindustan english paper so the new surrogacy bill protect the interest of all it will help childless couples while ensuring that the surrogate mother and the child do not suffer research done by world health organization who estimated that 2010 14.5 million couples worldwide were unable to have a child of their own they suffered from infertility which the who says is a disease of the reproductive system definitely by a failure to achieve a clinical pregnancy after 12 months or more of a regular unprotected sexual intercourse given the advancement in the medical science couples have been trying different different medical solution to have a different children Over the years, India has become the hub of the global fertility industry, with the reproductive medical tourism becoming a significant activity. Clinics in India have been offering assisted reproductive technology (ART) services such as a gamete donation, intrauterine insemination, in in vitro fertilization. intracytoplasmic sperm injection pre pre implantation genetic diagnosis and the gestational surrogacy surrogacy in particularly has drawn many childless couples to in india to the last few decades surrogacy is an arrangement where women the surrogate offer to carry a baby through pregnancy on behalf of a couple and then return the baby to the intended parents once it's born Broadly, surrogacy is two types: traditional and gestational. Traditional surrogacy involves uh, insemination of the surrogate naturally or artificially with the semen of the male uh, partner of the childless couple. A child born this way is genetically related to the surrogate mother. This has several ethical, social, and legal implications in the case of the gestational surrogacy. An embryo from the woman and a sperm of the intended couple is fertilized in a test tube and transferred to the womb of the surrogate. A child born through gestational surrogacy has no genetic similarity to the surrogate mother. While many couples benefited from surrogacy facilities in India, the practice has persisted without any legal framework, working only on the basis of vague guidelines. Under these circumstances, there have been many reported incidents of the unethical practices sur- surrounding surrogacy. These practices include the exploitative exploitations of the surrogate mother. abandonment of the children born or out surrogacy and the import of the human embryos and gametes there have been there have been there has been a widespread condemnation of commercial surrogacy because of this very so in 2014 an australian couple refused to accept one of their biological twins from through surrogacy because the gender of the child many poor women in india took to becoming surrogate mothers repeatedly despite grave implication to their health despite this commercial surrogacy was upheld by the supreme court judgment in the case of the baby manji versus union of india similarly in the case of the jan balaj versus anand municipality the gujarat high court sc reiterated the apex court judgment upholding commercial surrogacy the supreme the high court said commercial surrogacy was held to legal in india as there was no law prohibiting womb womb lending or surrogacy agreement in its 228th report presented in 2009 the law commission of india recommended that surrogacy be regulated through um, suitable legislation the law commission recommended the only uh, Altruistic surrogacy be legalized and commercial surrogacy be totally banned. The Surrogacy Regulations Bill 2019 was passed by the Lok Sabha on August 5th. The Rajya Sabha, in its meeting held on November 21, 2019, adopted motion to refer the bill to Select Committee. The committee studied the best practices in surrogacy globally, keeping in mind Indian needs. 
in the United States and Argentina, surrogacy requested requests are decided by independent surrogacy committee. In the United Kingdom, Netherlands, Ireland, Denmark, Belgium, South Africa, Australia, Canada, Greece, only altruistic surrogacy is allowed. Commercial surrogacy is legally allowed in countries like Russia, Ukraine, Thailand. In France, Germany, Spain, Sweden, Italy, Iceland, and surrogacy is banned in all forms. So in this country, France, Germany, Spain, Sweden, Italy, and Iceland, surrogacy is absolutely banned. The surrogacy regulation bill is an ethical, moral, social legislation as it protects the exploitation of the surrogate born through surrogacy. It seeks to constitute a national surrogacy board, a state surrogacy boards, and appointment to appropriate authorities for regulation of the practice and process of the surrogacy. To begin with, the couple seeking surrogacy will have to provide coupling, compelling conditions for warning a children through surrogacy. They have to, to be Indians, but can also be a non-resident Indian persons of the Indian origin or overseas citizen of India. The surrogate needs to be a married and have their child as some proceedings of surrogacy may lead to infertility. Single women cannot opt to have a child through surrogacy, but exceptions have been made for widows and divorced women if they obtain a certificate of the recommendation from the National Surrogacy Board. An insurance coverage of 16 months is proposed for the surrogate mother to take care of all her medical needs in case of surrogacy, emergency conditions, complications, surrogacy clinics cannot undertake surrogacy related procedure unless they are registered with the appropriate authority. Surrogacy is a blessing for many childless couples. The bill tries to ensure that while the childless couples get they want nobody including the surrogate mother and the children born out of surrogacy suffer. Bhupender Sri Bhupender Singh Yadav is an MP and chairman of Raj Sabha Select Committee on Surrogacy Law. These views expressed are personal. So thank you very much to watch my program. Wish you all the best. God bless. God bless you.